Yo prometo el altar a la bandera de los Estados Unidos de América y a la república que representa. Una nación bajo Dios, entera, con libertad y justicia para todos. Welcome back to another edition of Jack TV. I'm Joaquin. And I'm Shiloh. Let's get into our show for today. Today is the third day of Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Let's get into our daily fact for today. Oh, hi there. My name is Javi, and Latinx, or also known as Hispanic Heritage Month, is here, and we are celebrating all month long. Together, let's take the time to recognize and appreciate the Latinx history, culture, and community that makes this country so amazing. Have you ever wondered why people love baseball? Is it the strategy of the game? Batter, batter, swing! Batter, batter, swing! Batter, batter, swing! Crack of the bat as it hits the ball? The cheer of the crowd or the smell of the hot dogs at the stadium? Or maybe it is the individual players? Well, one notable Latino baseball player that everyone seemed to love was Roberto Clemente. Born in 1934, Roberto Clemente was a Puerto Rican professional baseball right fielder who played 18 seasons in Major League Baseball for the Pittsburgh Pirates. After his early death in 1972, he became both the first Caribbean American and the first Latino player to be inducted into the National Baseball Hall of Fame. Roberto Clemente fue el primer jugador hispano inducido en el Salón de la Fama del Béisbol. Thanks for that. Now into our quick sports recap. On Friday, we have an exhilarating homecoming football game against Bethesda Chevy Chase with a final score of 14-13 Northwest. And today we have the Golf Code District at Poolsville. And here matches for the girls and guys in field hockey starting at 5.30 and 6.30 respectively. Now for a few short announcements. Hall Swift will begin again starting this week. Make sure you start showing up to your classes on time to avoid that. And on a similar note, detentions will be given for targets. And for our sophomores and juniors, the PSAT will be next week on Wednesday, October 11th, starting at 7.45. If you're not taking the PSAT, school will start normally at 12.05. Night and day are having their auditions on Thursday. The Google Form to audition on their Instagram closes tomorrow. Make sure to do it if you ain't haven't already. They are also looking for a, a videographer. If you're interested, check their Instagram. <laughs> Let's talk about the seal of biliteracy. Hablemos ahora sobre el sello de bilingüismo. Are you a senior or a junior? Are you also bilingual? Here's what you've been waiting for. ¿Eres un senior y o un junior? ¿También eres bilingüe? Aquí ha llegado lo que has estado esperando. The state of Maryland seal of biliteracy. El sello de bilingüismo del estado de Maryland. We will host two information sessions, the first on Friday, October 13th, and the second on Monday, October 16th, where in room 207. Mark your calendars. Tendremos dos sesiones informativas, una el viernes 13 de octubre y otra el, ma el lunes, <laughs> octubre 16. ¿Dónde? En el salón 207. Marca tu calendario. Don't forget, if you have questions, ask a language teacher. Also, you can email Astrid underscore E underscore Argueta at mcpsmd.org or you can simply attend an information session. Para más información, recuerda que siempre puedes preguntarle a un maestro de idiomas 
puedes enviarle un correo electrónico a la señora Astrid Argueta arroba mcpsmd.org o también puedes visitarnos en una sesión informativa. Te esperamos. We will see you. On that note, make sure to follow us on Instagram at nwjacktv. We'll eventually start running polls for you to vote on certain news segments. We, also, we will also be posting new in information and updates as well. And before we leave, our birthdays. Thanks for tuning in. I've been Joaquin. And I've been Shiloh. See you tomorrow.